deep. He's going to be all over the place, Tim. Not the shimmy shake. It came earlier than that. <laughs> Here's Burmeister. He's a dual threat. Team. There goes Royce. It was his. Comes underneath here and works his way back underneath against away from a three man foreman formation the opposite side of him. The numbers game, they're already playing it early, Tim. Run where they ain't. 16 yards on that carry. Here's the RPO, and it goes to Taj Griffin. He stopped down 11. Wide receiver screen again to Griffin. Get out here. It's Freeman, and he stopped. Stoned at the line of scrimmage. And he may have come away with a fun direction coming here. It's kind of a starward charge. Everybody's coming to the right side, filling that gap. That's what it's about. Integrity in Rich putting pressure. Third and seven. That was a quarterback draw all the way. Burmeister bounces off Cougars. Just shy of the first down. Well, the ball came loose late. But I think they. He takes it inside the 25 to the 24-yard line. Second down, long Benoit again. So it is first down. Another base run formation for him. Not this time. Benoit stopped in his track. And to make is all the way to the eight-yard line. Nice. Benoit. Well, guess up for big yards. Third down and short now. Burmeister, nice spin move uh, at the bottom yeah. of your screen. They're going to run it. Benoit, down to the five. Beautiful. Benoit, down to the one. Got yards. Can I again? And the Cougars were waiting for him this time. This is going to be a pressure look here on the inside. They are stemming late to that look, which allows the little bodies to come fill those voids. When you vacate his for his father, Jack, and his coaching career has been outstanding at every stop, including Western Kentucky. Freeman stopped by Nate Durant. Talk about that a little bit more after this play. Freeman in traffic again, outstanding penetration. But for the first time, he's been able to hire a coaching staff without having to worry about a budget. Here's Freeman. That screen action. Well, the Ducks defense has played well to this point, but so too has Washington State. You've really got to be in Pitch to the wide side, and it's Darian McNeil, 89. Burmeister. Pass just off the fingertips. And 654 and counting in the first half. Roy Freeman breaks free. I tell you, just his vision, the way he sees things, and the way it develops, makes one guy miss. The, not a false step inside, Tim. He's just a true step in the ability to run from it. Here he goes again inside the 35. This is Charles White. Wide gaping hole, another opportunity for him. But again, the thing that I like about his game, he will front. I mean, he's going to pass Marcus Allen at some point in all those yards. There's Breeland, the tight end. It's incomplete. Think about the, these names. Third and one. Why not? He may not have gotten there, though. I think he's short he on the year. And they go jet sweep to Taj Griffin, and he's got it. Should have it. Sorry, yeah. I don't know. He may have gotten the left foot spot. Well, he should have bounced it outside anyway. Yeah. Again, the, the, the edge is what he was looking for. I know he's trying to get to it. Freeman remains the setback. Wide receiver screen, and they go to Schooner. And he stopped after only maybe a year. Johnny Johnson, the third number 80, is flanked to that side. Burmeister looking long into double coverage, and that should be. Well, it was in position. Royce Freeman in the backfield on third and 15 for the Ducks. Burmeister trying to get it done on his own and is going to be stopped at the 37 yard lines on first and 10 with the ball at the 39. See if they can get some points before the intermission. And that's Schooner, 86. Burmeister rolls and again towards the boundary. It's Schooner. His poise is there. On first down. He gets out of some trouble. This is his specialty. Wisely ushers him to get before the break. 
Burmeister over the middle. Breland, the tight end. Well, that movement got him again. No fly though. Here's Burmeister. Great. Uh, Matt Liner at halftime mentioned to take some of the shackles off of the freshman quarterback in this second half. Royce Freeman. To, yeah, they're going to do it this time. Oh, no. Burmeister takes it. Nice ad lib job on his part to get it underneath has been a go to guy number 86 can get on track here. This pass is thrown to Johnny Johnson. He'll be to him because he was a pure go to receiver. Griffin. Only need a yard this time. On the zone read. He lost the ball. It's on the ground. Washington State looks to have it. Can't say enough how important it is that. They take the shackles off, and this will help Tony Brooks James. Remember, well, you can get hurt that way. He stopped very quickly. Burmeister again stepping up. Even then, touchdown reception. He's in the slot to the left. Brooks James. Blitz. Yep, right up the middle, and the freshman didn't see it. Nothing doing for Burmeister tries to cut it back up and gets instead he runs right into the teeth of the numbers The opportunity is this gaping hole on the back side again the option to be able to make that decision Royce Freeman remains in the backfield as we open the fourth quarter looking long and it's intercepted Taken out of there by Marcus Strong And Burmeister knocks him out of us when they were young have to buy in, and he certainly has with Mario Cristobal and company. Burmeister flushed again. Lots of green space in front of him. Took a heavy duty hit as he was. Just true. Yeah. Even Saban disciples have not fared as well mm -hmm. as Le Leach's, no question. Pass is incomplete. That's Benoit. But I'm a little surprised to see this. And I have been trying to get to the edge and can't as that I remember seeing in recent memory yeah, what Alex Grinch has done with this unit given What he has to work with Tim uh, and well, another interception yeah, here on off the Meister from the 45 they run option and that is snuffed out quickly, but Quick out for schooler again You know Lost the snap just dropped it and then had to heave it out of bounds in the direct week Time running out and down he goes